So yes, finally, finally, finally. So of course, back winner really quick. Uh, of course, um, I'm gonna go with that. Turn it on a little bit. A little loud for me. So yeah, um, yeah, that was like a little loud for me though. But yeah, of course, we got the new news for Pokemon Go. We got the, all the July news. Again, this always happens right before Community Day, like after we get Community Day news. Of course, we get, um, of course, which I think, right? We get, the, of course, the next info, like the next month we had last time for Dino. Then, yeah, he was June. Then we got confirmed, of course, the June info last month. June was so really good. I actually did like June myself for Pokemon Go this year. I think that did a really good job. Uh, July didn't seem that bad as well. Again, like I said, we got like two or three events pretty much every month at this point. Um, this is how the format's been for like the last couple months. Like two or three events. Uh, two of them were, or three, two of them were at least announced in the course. So, like, one's kind of like a mystery, pretty much. But yeah. Um, it didn't take too, too long, of course, going both all the info and everything, of course, for Pokemon Go. Like I said, pretty quick, pretty simple, pretty easy to go today. Um, yeah, shouldn't be that long, shouldn't take too, too long to go over everything, of course. But, yeah, let's go ahead and get started with of course. So, like I said, it's going to be a little more short of a shorter video today. But, this is a short arc, I'm going to talk a lot, a lot, and, of course, a little bit more, because I like to kind of do it during my videos. So, of course, you know, let's go ahead and get started everything, of course. Yeah, like I said though, um, for this month it's not that bad. I think it's pretty decent. We got some good decent stuff in here. Some stuff to guess, keep the content going for Pokemon Go pretty much. But um, yeah. Uh, I think it's gonna be actually a pretty decent month. So yeah, I'm a little bit quiet and all of that just cause. Again, a little bit of that stuff like that of course. And of course in general, again, more content for the channel, you know. So yeah. And most of that night, I just saw really, pretty much the only free time I can back to myself could during the day. I'm usually busy doing YouTube stuff though, or just a little stuff in general life, just um, RL stuff and everything, just texting my friends or just dumb job hunting or just in something in general. But um, yeah, but yeah, like I said though, um, it's been like crazy the last couple of weeks anyway though. But yeah, um, this month doesn't seem that bad though. We look like we got the Alga back, um, we got a couple good Megas in here, and of course one Mega Pitch on here. <laughs> that of course, we all mentioned that was gonna be really cool, probably very clean stars coming to be community day, which um, I should have pulled up beforehand, I didn't think about that. But yeah, certainly it's getting community day. Uh, I'll probably upload that before the goes up, probably. I might do that actually. Just because Starly has. I, I don't know. Well, yeah, I don't even know what. To, yeah, it's, it's really weird. It's just getting. Yeah, recording a lot of stuff like out of order, recording stuff trying to get it out early. It's just all over the place and everything, of course. Though. So yeah, of course, let's go ahead and get started and everything, of course. So of course, we've got July 2022 content. Um, let me do this. Get my comfort position. Um, but yeah, about that, like Omega Chad. Buff position, you gotta be definitely see my bustles of course flicking out and stuff like that, of course. But yeah, let's go ahead and get started with everything. Let's go we got July 2022 content. Uh, of course, we got July 1st again, typical, you know, 1 a.m. slash p.m., of course. Uh, time for, it looks like 1 p.m. usually time for this, but still, um, it's big downtime. For me, anyway, it's usually uh, 1 a.m. more like, yeah, it is 1 a.m., but a little time for me. Dumb, let the box come in. It's of course from July to August 1st. Wait, it's almost about to hit August, it's crazy, it's weird, it's really, really weird. Really. I just hit my hug for me because it's always used like, to go for people and stuff like that. I don't know, it's kind of bad about that. Because uh, we got a good time this time around. Again, yeah, no, not bad choices. Shiny is actually just really good. Uh, it's a gold. It's going to look like a king. Um, yeah, they're about to come over this month. But yeah, a lot of pink this month. This feels very Valentine's Day. Maybe like kind of Valentine's Day. But love this. I like that Valentine's Day 2022 this year. But yeah. Um, yeah, we got. Um, I think. Who am I going to use for them now? I might use Arctic now. I could use Dialga or Palkia. I'm not using. I already used Mega Charizard X for the other Pokemon. I use Electricina for this. I might use Iago. I don't know who I'm gonna use for the thumbnail. I didn't even think about the. Even that, I didn't make Brandon really just make Pokemon Go thumbnails anyway though. So I got I already got like a balls. I already got the balls while we're done. I had to make a, a time for Squirtle. I didn't make a Rocket Tree thumbnail. Just because again, this, I used to do Pokemon Go more than probably anything really Pokemon on my channel. Just um, you know, in general. So I was like, yeah, I get more coverage to have to go because it's like, it's, I had to cut it anyway. So, yeah. But yeah, of course, we got um, Arthur Canoe, of course, we got all the Jotar birds coming back, and of course, the Alga. So, of course, we got um, July 1st through 7th, and of course, Red Hour will be on the 6th for Arthur Kuno. That does will be on 7th through 14th. Uh, Red Hour will be on the 13th of July uh, this year, so all that. Uh, Mortis will be on the 14th of 22, uh, 22, 22nd, 
the red arrow will be on the 20th, the arc will be on the 22nd, so the 31st. Kind of random one, I thought it was going to be Ho Ho or Bikia coming back, but we got that a lot last year. Yeah, we got, we got, yeah, we got Shadow, Apex, Ho Ho, Lukia. Yeah, then we, got, then we got Shadow back too, I think. By what, July? August? I can't remember, that was crazy. Yeah, but the other coming back, that's kind of random. I thought it was like, like Ho Ho or something, but no, we just had the Jojo Tour too. Makes sense, makes sense. Just hit me in the head. Definitely does. Definitely, definitely, definitely does make sense. Uh, that'll be July 22nd to the 31st. Red Arrow will be on the 29th. can all my chance to be shiny. So that's both. Okay, no, okay. I, I can't see because the, the, the white dot means it's shiny. has a shiny chance. I did not see that at all. Okay. Because I, like, I was like, I know Motrix is a shiny in the game. Good thing I know is that tells us to come out right after one. I bet it's right. So X will be back, will be back on the 1st to the 7th. Um, Weekly the little rates have been coming back on. They do the foot tutorial tour as well. Like every week or like like every hour had like a new raid, like had like Entei, um, Suicune, um, Raikou. It was insane. The Dodo tour was insane for me. Um, got a lot of these new Pokemon I had. So Mega Charles are actually back. Again, these didn't make rehashing raids, just got the new raid update and stuff like that. Definitely does make sense and stuff like that, of course, though. For me, again, like I said, definitely, definitely, definitely does make sense why they're bringing back and everything. Um, it's not about that, of course, but yeah. Of course, Charizard will be on the 11th, uh, July the 7th, the 1st, and the 4th, the 7th. Uh, X will have the 7th, the 14th. Pidgeot will have the 14th, the 22nd. And of course, the 22nd to the 31st will have Gengar. So like I said, pretty much every week we'll get a new raid for like a whole week of July, though. So pretty much, yeah. Again, this would be super simple, super easy, and stuff like that, of course. Just because, again, they want you, like, the Mega Ball Pokemon, use the Mega Ball Pokemon raid. I guess one more comes to the game later, like throw it on the road, Mega Charizard. Wow. Oh no, because it's flying type, never mind, flying a dragon. Yeah, you gotta want to use electric, electric type, come on. Of course, we got the spot hours, but that'll be 6, 6 p.m. to 7 p.m. local time, so whatever time it is for you, that'll be your own um, time and stuff like that, of course. Uh, we have Little Bug on the 5th with times to catch. So yeah, time to catch experience. Uh, much travel on the 12th, having time to catch candy. Dang, that's a W right there because Machop has a good shiny. And Machop is probably one of the best flying type Pokemon in the game. Plus, with times for candy, that right there was probably honestly worth it. That's all. Honestly, really worth it. Sorry, you're not a bad Pokemon because I think it's really good for like Great League, I believe. Um, it'll, have it'll have time to trip for candy. Of course, Bad Time will have time to evolve the XP. They've been doing this a lot though. Or swapping back and forth from that end. Stardust, 17th of July, of course. Could the community day for July of this year. 2022 will have Starly. Of course, our Raptor will have Gus. Did it? I could have heard the number of my dog. What is it from? I don't know. Um, of course, we had that with Gus. Again, I already made a whole video for Star Raptor and everything. Has a new shiny debut. A new shiny, new debut. Has Gus. Um, I went over that already in some video. Go ahead, go that. We have Gus Fest, of course, Berlin. We have In Person, of course, Pants here, and of course, um, Bunga's Game Chinese. I have Dark Brown Cresselia that have Chinese as well. It'll be July 1st to the 3rd. Again, we're going to get Ultra Beast pretty much every single day. I mean, I'll that already. Uh, July 6th to the 12th, we'll have a Pokemon Go anniversary event, which I completely forgot about that. In July slash June, Pokemon Go just have its anniversary. It makes sense because they came out during the summertime um, of 2015, I think. 15? 2016? Yeah, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. They were definitely just five years old. Yeah, because what, 2021? 2020, 2019, 2020. Yeah, 2016, 2015. Uh, whatever, which one? Um, I forgot already. So yeah, again, last year I think we had fossil events, we had like, the show the stars, stars coming back. And again, we're good seeing this stuff like that. Because I could do the 21st, because we have um, the Seattle and personal have Pampor and Combi Chinese. And of course, from 27th to the 2nd, we'll have a mysterious event with a special event, including Pokemon debuts and new adventures. So basically, a Pokemon game debut. I wonder what it's going to be. It's going to be like a water type. Yeah. I don't know what's gonna be like a new Mega maybe? They could drop a new Mega and stuff like that. But yeah, overall for July, not that bad for a month. It's decent. I think they're really good. Oh, all the raids seem really, really worth it. A lot of people are gonna be farming out Dialga. Dialga. Um, all the birds. All, like, all these are really worth the raids though. Again, like saving the Megas. Like, they were trying to make those a lot easier. And these raids, of course, make them off and come on a lot before. Um, but yeah, overall, like, the raids aren't that bad. Spot Hour, D2, I think, are really went worth it. Venture's not a bad one. It does have a decent shiny in the future. Little Bug, probably not, but these ones are definitely not. All a little bit better. It's about a couple months. Those Spot Hours were kind of, kind of, eh. But the Community Day, I went over a full video for that, breaking that down. Typical stuff. Uh, we went over these already in some of the video, but the Pokemon Go event, like, last year, we're gonna have a new, um, 
Um, of course, that first round for Pokemon and stuff like that, of course. That's super simple and easy. We got um, Seattle, of course, like I said. Uh, I think we have like one more for this. I think it was like Seattle, Berlin, and, like the other one. Was it like Spain? I can't remember one of those countries had it. Because it has like a tree, both wall, and a fair amount of in the event. Of course, we've got a new series event. Like, they always use all right. They always have to do a Pokemon or something new. A series event, like I said, pretty much every month. Three or four events pretty much a month. Every week at this point, I'll probably want to. Because it's been like that for But yeah, not bad for July though. Pretty good stuff. A lot of good stuff to farm out. A lot of good stuff to, you know, again, these, these are going to be worth it. These are all going to be really worth it. So, a couple months are actually not that still ball in hours. So, again, Community Day Shaft. It's decent. Again, new shiny in the game. Um, that's honestly pretty much really why you're going to do it. Gus is okay. Yeah, like I said, they really just, like, probably don't the best flying like in the game. Compared to this, yeah, sorry, just, this is just way better than this, sorry I said that. But, um, I want to really this different video, or over this, you know, this pretty much interesting video, like, going over for the new event with the new, um, Ultra Beast and stuff like that, not bad. I, I can't wait for the anniversary event, they, those are usually really good. There's only going to be a couple of days, though, so, it's going to be a shaft. But, um, yeah. Um, then of course we got a new series event again, new Pokemon DDP, probably another one of Pokemon they're gonna rehash, a new one, probably. Not rehash by new one though, so yeah. See you guys though, thanks so much for watching, have a great day, quite a lot of you know. So I say thanks for watching, and God bless all of you for going out, and we're mad, so it's something we're really into. So I say it again, go outside, text with guys, copy him, um, check out some of my friends, Vampy, Draw, Moth, um, Spirited, Grab, Ayu, Yuki, Wolf, uh, Wolfie, so, uh, Emmy, everybody in my Discord, they're all freaking insane and awesome. So yeah, I can think of all this freaking stuff for that, of course. Um, and all my new friends that I met on Twitter, that they, she's on pretty cool too. So I can think of all this stuff for that, of course, just like to create it again. Very simple, very easy stuff like I said, though. If I get any video there, this month of July, not bad. It's a, it's a good bump. Uh, compared to June, though, June was so good. But this one is not bad. Uh, just because, again, it's Dog Community Day. Again, pretty much everyone's going to be going to Shining. That's pretty much it, because otherwise, Gus was Star Raptor. Not really good. Again, you got picked you up right there, so like a perfect example of like you yeah, already just kicked him out of the meta right there in general. Because I think, yeah, so it's not really good. Like, the like, Great League's okay for it, but then like Gold League like, and Master League, not really. Um, the birds are coming back, so of course, really the Mega Raid seems like really good, but no one's gonna do those anyway. Everyone's gonna be after these ones. But yeah, like I said, getting that orange raid pass. Again, they want to get that orange and green raid pass. Yay, forget the daily ones you always used to get. Or putting me on the bundle box again, like they did. They give us a back in the bundle box again, so this is gonna be random. We'll probably give them a random bundle box. Look at me, we can't do it there. But yeah, uh, this probably always really worth it. I say I want to farm this one out, so it's really worth it. But um, yeah, super simple, do your good stuff. It's easy. Super simple, super beasy, easy, beasy stuff. I just said beasy stuff. Super simple, beasy stuff. Okay, yeah, okay, I'm gonna be on that. That was just perfectly cold. See you guys later, though, okay, nope.